Hi everyone, this is Ananta Paulus and you are watching Ananta Paulus TV. And today I just wanted to make this short little video about distant healing with Reiki because one thing I often get asked by people is if I do my distant healing or distant attunement sessions via WhatsApp or Skype or over the phone and I realized that a lot of Reiki practitioners or energy healing practitioners they do healing sessions over the phone or Skype or you know some kind of uh, media but that's just not how I have ever been doing it and I understand that on one hand for some people it is easier to build a connection if they are talking to the person over the phone or over Skype or WhatsApp whatever it is they prefer and also the person receiving the healing session or the attunement they feel that there is somebody at the other end who is doing something for them but I do want to stress on the fact that Reiki or energy healing or distant healing was practiced by our ancestors ages ago even when there was no social media there was no internet there was no phone and it was still being done as effectively as it has ever been done so how do you think our ancestors were doing healing sessions or Reiki attunements Sorry about that noise, it gets a little noisy at the beach sometimes. So how do you think our ancestors were doing it without internet or without telephone connection? So it's intention that always matters when it comes to energy work. You don't have to create or build a connection through the internet. You don't need WhatsApp or Skype or phone in order to be doing a healing session. In fact, I even tell in my Reiki classes that you don't even need the person's name or picture in order to be doing a healing session for them. I'll get into all those details maybe in a different video. I get into the details of distant healing in my Reiki level 2 classes. But for now what I really want to stress on is the fact that energy healing really works through your intention. You don't have to create the connection through the internet or the phone line. We are already energetically interconnected. The connection is already there and it is the intention that makes the healing work or the attunement work. So as long as the intention is there, it is going to work. In fact, in my distant healing sessions, I find it more distracting than helpful if I am sitting on Skype or on phone doing the healing session. It's way more convenient for me and I'm able to focus much better if I'm just in my grounded, clear space where there is no other distraction from you know talking on a phone or a Skype I'm able to focus better and channel the energies better if I'm doing a healing session where there is no phone or Skype I know a lot of healers and practitioners they do on Skype and on phone and that's absolutely fine maybe they are still able to focus as well you know uh, even with a Skype or a phone call going on but just personally for me it just works better and I just wanted to clear the you know the misconception that you need to be on Skype or on phone to be doing a healing session to build a connection because the connection is already there we are all energetically interconnected and the universe does not need Skype connection for that connection to happen the Reiki energy just works through intention so I hope that was clear and if you like this video then please like and leave a comment and subscribe to my channel bye for now